Hello and welcome to the Cryptocurrency News Channel. Let's talk about Tesla and why their report, when it came out, actually made Bitcoin drop. It's only down about a thousand points since, and I don't think it's going to go down that much more. But it was not because of Tesla's earnings. Tesla's earnings per share actually significantly beat the market expectations by about 20%. Tesla shares actually went up in after hours trading, at least at the time of making this video. Now, the other thing is uh, Tesla's revenues did not meet expectations, but they only fell short by about less than, by about like 1%. So it didn't really matter all that much. Overall, it was a positive report for Tesla. Um, even though they sold less cars than in Q1, they did sell more cars than the same period last year. Obviously, supply chain problems are constraining them from producing a lot, and their Shanghai factory has basically been closed for all of Q2. So that is part of the problem right there. But um, it's not that that actually caused Bitcoin to drop because of the Tesla news. Bitcoin dropped because uh, due to the Tesla news because Tesla actually revealed that they sold $936 million worth of Bitcoin in Q2. And that's because they need, uh, Tesla's a public company. Sometimes they need things on their balance sheet to actually work out. So selling Bitcoin was their best course of action. Um, a public company does not work the same way as an individual. No one is forcing us to sell out to make uh, amends meet in our balance sheet. But sometimes public companies actually have to do that. So they took the easiest course of action, which is selling out their Bitcoin. You can argue whether that was wise or not. I'm not really interested in arguing with you whether that's wise or not. I don't think it was wise. But, you know, like it's what, you know, what Tesla does with their balance sheet. I don't really know their internal workings. And it just could be because of very many various reasons. But just because Tesla and Elon Musk decided to sell out some Bitcoin does not mean you should. Some people stupidly think Elon Musk is the, sh uh, is the truth and the light. He is not. They actually think he's the godfather of crypto. He is not. They think he's very knowledgeable about crypto. And he is not that either. In fact, Elon Musk's knowledge of crypto is very, very limited and very, very little. If he said something about electric vehicles, maybe you should listen. If he said something about making rocket spaceships, maybe you should listen. But if he says something about crypto, he's really not worth listening to. You know how we know? Because he chose Dogecoin, which is a coin with very little actual utility, to basically troll the crypto market. That's right, people. In the crypto world, Elon Musk is nothing but a giant troll and should not really be taken seriously when he actually says thing about, things about crypto. He's not really interested in crypto. He just likes it. He likes to use crypto to actually get attention. And you should really not pay any attention to him when he says something about cryptocurrency. However, he does have a bunch of brainless followers or thralls that basically will basically feed on his every action and basically do everything that Elon Musk does no matter what. So after Tesla announced that they actually sold Bitcoin, a lot of those guys probably sold out and that's why Bitcoin went down because a lot of the followers basically like sold in the minutes after it was announced that Tesla sold, even though there was no reason to, and Bitcoin dumped um, a couple hundred points it then rose back and then dumped again. And now we're about a thousand points down. I don't think we're going to dump that much more. Crypto usually does follow the stock market. The stock futures are pretty much flat right now. And I don't really see any kind of major event tomorrow that would actually cause crypto to sink down. I think people are going to be tenuous tomorrow and over the weekend because um, the GDP numbers come out next week. That's going to confirm whether or not we're in a recession. And I think the market's going to react to that. And besides that, the interest rate hikes will also... Uh, come out next week. I don't really know what they're going to determine at the FOMC meeting, but it's either going to be 75 basis points or 100 basis points. Now, if there's 75 basis points, I think the market will actually go up. If it's 100 basis points, the market will probably go down. The housing market is coming down because the interest rate is much, much higher. So is the cars market. But overall, um, I don't expect crypto to go down that much more. I'm hoping for 25,000 by the end of this week, but that may not happen because I don't see... Uh, anything to actually boost it back up unless earnings are actually really, unless more earnings come out tomorrow and they're really, really good. But that's actually why uh, Bitcoin dumped today. Uh, it's because Tesla sold off 936 million over Q2. And then like, you know, once that was revealed, a bunch of the Elon Musk thralls actually sold off as well. So that's the news for today. Let me know what you think. Like and subscribe, hit that bell notifications button. Thank you and have a nice day.